Hi YouTubers, it's Smoking Essie Success again for the second video, second video today. Why, why am I making another video today, you ask? Well, I just want to talk about it, so um, bear with me. Okay, now I want to talk about Hearth and Home Tobacco. Now, Hearth and Home Tobacco is a tobacco that um, pipes and cigars personally blends, and I want to give my overall opinion of it. So, Hearth and Home Tobacco, such as this pipe tobacco right here, this is a big can of Ambassador's Blend. And I just want to give, let me just put this over there. <clears throat> this is um, my overall opinion of Harford Home Tobacco. Now, I have um, smoked a lot of Harford Home Tobacco. My favorite blend for them is Armanda, which is kind of like a Latakia, um, you know, full body Latakia blend. Quote, English blend. So, I smoked a lot of Harford Home Tobacco, and I want to give my overall opinion of it. So, okay, now that I'm settled. Um, Harford Home Tobacco is not bad, I will say that first of all. First off, you know, it's not a bad tobacco. I mean, they're not bad tobaccos, you know, bad pipe tobaccos. They have their pros and cons. Harvard Home Tobacco is very, very, how do I put it? Very good, but it has its, it has its pros and cons, like I said. So, first off, you know, all the tobaccos um, are very cheap, you know, they are very relatively cheap. You have to order them online or go to their store, which is located in Pennsylvania, so, most people order online, unless you live in Pennsylvania, so they're very cheap, so they're budget tobaccos. Even the big cans of the tobaccos for eight that are, is they come in both bulk and, and uh, tins or cans, um, they're very budget, effect, budget effective, so they're cheap. They're not expensive. A big 8 ounce can only costs about $17 compared to other tobaccos like GLPs, which can be like, you know, $25, $30, $40. So they're pretty um, cost effective. Now some of the downsides to them are they tend to come dry. Um, most of the tobaccos are blended pretty dry. The blender is Russ. Um, I forget his last name, but his first name is Russ. And he blends their tobaccos. So their pipe tobaccos. So now they are they do come on the drier side. So they're kind of like Cornell and Dio tobacco where they come more drier. And that's not necessarily a bad thing. Now one of the big big downsides to them is they do burn very fast. I have had a lot of their tobaccos, um, Larry's Blend, Ambassador's Blend, Armanda, um, a lot of their blends, and they do tend to burn on the fast side, even when packed very well. Even if you pack them very, very well and very tightly, they do tend to burn fast, which is a downside. Most pipe smokers, me included, like to smoke our pipes for 30 minutes, 45 minutes, you know, hour. Their tobaccos tend to burn more like on the end of, more on the side of, you know, 20 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes, so they are for, they are fast burning tobaccos. So the pros to them are, um, they taste very similar, so if you like the flavor of them, they're good, you know, if you like the flavor, like for example, they're Latakia blends, or English, English blends, Latakia blends. They're Latakia tobaccos, they're Balkan tobaccos, tobaccos that contain Latakia tastes very similar. So if you're if you like one of their their Latakia tobaccos, you'll probably like the other ones. Um, to me personally, myself, they all taste very similar to the Latakia blends. They have a very 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 similar taste. That's good because I do like their Latakia tobaccos. More of the downsides to them are well obviously you have to order online unless you live in Pennsylvania, so that might be a downside. And there are some states I think that you can't order online. So um you might not be able to sample their tobacco or, or try their tobacco if you if you can't order online, unless you live in Pennsylvania. So that's another downside. But overall, Harvard Home Tobacco are not bad. The big downsides to them are they burn very fast and they can they can burn kind of hot, uh, especially in the bottom half of the pipe. They do burn a little hot. Um, I've personally have tried their, their aromatics, you know, because I'm not an aromatic smoker personally. I mean, I will occasionally buy aromatic, you know very occasionally. I know they make something called eggnog in Grandma's Kitchen, which are aromatics, you know, they're kind of like a spicy, you know, spicy aromatics, you know, not spicy, like hot spicy, and you know, like, um, you know, like a spice, you know, like a, like a cooking spice. So, um, yeah, those are, um, sp supposed to be good. Uh, eggnog's supposed to be good, I, I hear. Um, other tobaccos they make, um, their blender, uh, their other blender, Scotty, makes, um, some blends called milk and honey, uh, blueberry pancake, um, pumpkin cheesecake, and um, other blends like that. 
Those are actually good. I actually do like their those aromatics a little bit. I have tried blueberry pancake and it's very good. But um, overall opinion of them, overall opinion of, of Hearth Home tobaccos, pipes and cigar tobaccos as a whole, they have their upsides and they also have their downsides. So they have their pros and cons. Uh, their pros are they're very cost effective, they're very cheap, you know, their their service is very good, their website is very good, very easy, you know, website to use, so they're very easy to obtain as long as you live in a state where you can get tobacco shipped to you. And they are very, very cheap. The downsides are they do burn very fast and they are so if you if you want to smoke a pipe for a long time, don't buy half known tobacco because it burns like wildfire. So even if you pack it very well. Anyway, that's about it. So comment, rate, subscribe, personal stuff if you want to. And I might eventually make this a series. Um, meaning I might actually start doing uh le much later in the future, I might actually do a series on overall opinions of tobacco companies and tobacco blenders. So anyway, I might do that. So comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, 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 later, bye.